Hi DIYers, Joe here from Alarm Grid, and today we're going to talk about which sensors are compatible with the Qualysys IQ2 system. Now we have an IQ2 system mounted right here, and out of the box, the only sensors that it's going to work with are any sensors that work on the 319.5 frequency. These are Qualysys sensors and GE slash Interlogic sensors. Now the system does have a few options currently available to interface other sensors with the system and going forward Qualysys is actually going to release some stuff that's going to allow you to work with other sensors. So as far as those future options go, on the board there's actually three slots for daughter boards. What these are are modules that are going to allow the system to interface with other sensors. Uh, Qualsys so far has said that they, we believe that they're going to be releasing a daughter board for 433 sensors, for Honeywell 345 sensors, and for PowerG sensors. Um, this may change as time goes forward, and as far as we know, you're not able to buy the daughter boards separately from the system. So when they do start releasing these systems with the daughter boards, you'll be able to buy a new system with the daughter board pre-installed in the system. And this is going to make it real convenient if you have an older system installed in your house with a bunch of sensors that aren't directly compatible with the Qualysys and you want to install it. Having the daughter board in the system is going to allow you to install the IQ2 and program all the sensors right into your panel without having to do any additional stuff. It's going to make it really, really convenient. Currently though, there are a few options you can use to interface other sensors with the IQ2. Um, on the system, or for the system, uh, Qualysys has made a translator called the IQ Translator 345. We sell it on our website. That will actually allow the Qualysys to interface with Honeywell 5800 sensors as they do work on the 345 frequency and it will also allow it to interface with 2 gig sensors as they also work on the same frequency. We also sell a device called the Resolution 524. It's a universal wireless to wireless translator and that thing actually allows multiple different manufacturers to work with multiple other different manufacturers. And what I mean by that is there's two dials on the translator. One lets you say what the model of the sensors are that it's going to be translating and the other dial allows you to set it to tell uh, the type of system that's going to be sending the information to. So let's say you have Honeywell 345 series sensors in the home, or sensors that work on the 345 frequency, and you install a Qualsys, you'd set one dial to the Honeywell and one to Qualsys, and then it would translate them through and allow them to work with the system. As far as programming sensors to the system, it's really quite easy on the system. I'm going to walk through it just so you can see. On your panel, you're going to click this button, which will pull down the main menu, and then you're going to click on Settings. And we're going to click on advanced settings. We have everything defaulted so we'll enter 1111 which is the default installer code and then we'll do installation and then devices. Uh, next we'll do security sensors and we're going to do auto learn sensor. So now the panel's in listening mode and I have an analogic sensor right here and as you can see I just moved it away from the magnet which faulted the sensor and caused uh, the IQ2 to pick it up. I'm going to click OK that we want to learn it in. This is our sensor programming menu. I don't really feel like changing anything right now, so I'm just going to click Add New to program it in. And as you can see, the sensor is now in the system. So if we go all the way back to the main menu, and I take my magnet, we can see that the front door is open, telling us that we have successfully programmed in the sensor. Those are the sensors that are compatible with the Qualsys IQ2. If you did enjoy the video, feel free to subscribe. If you want to be updated when we post future videos, hit the notification button below and we'll send you an update when we do so. If you have any questions about alarm monitoring or alarms in general, head over to our website, www.alarmgrid.com. Give us a call at 888-818-7728 or send us an email to support at alarmgrid.com. We hope you have a great day and take care.